so today we are installing this bad boy on this bad boy. We have a little bit better tools to our disposal today because we're at Pierce's house. Where are you, Laura? What's up, guys? Proud uh, MK, no, proud Mark V owner. There you gotta go. Get, I gotta Mark get better five. at that. GT Atlas. No, no more, no more MK. No. Rage, a lot of people raging. <laughs> proud Mark V owner, but what happened to yours? Uh, it got sideswiped. Unfortunately, it's on the freeway. Out. So he has, a, he has a prelude right now, but he's looking to hop back in the Volkswagen game. GTI so. gang. That's right. But uh, in the meantime, let's install this bad boy. Oh, we're working on Shank's car. He's being yeah. a little shy today. Yeah. Not really. There we did the two month, two month up, two three month update, and then I bought it the weekend after. Yeah. <laughs> so, mods for the win. As long as there's no dent, let's get started. So we kind of realized that. I never, we never really did a before and after like revving. This is stock everything, stock downpipe, stock muffler. Now we don't have an aftermarket muffler to go with it. We just have the downpipe. So I, I uncharted territory for me. I don't really know if there's gonna be much difference, but um, this is what it sounds like stock. Everything, so. The single exit or the side exit for the dual tip exhaust, um, and so every time I see a GT, I'm like, why can't I do that? So I just realized. Oh, dude! <laughs> Take off these pieces right here, these braces, so we can get the pipe out. Then we're going to undo this right here. Then we're going to take off that V-band clamp way up there. The V-band way up there is what's holding it onto the turbo. Nice and simple, one bolt. Yeah, simple install. This is literally Pierce's perfect height. We're <laughs> yeah, we're. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, this is, our this legs is, are yeah, like, our we're, legs, we're our crashing, legs are just but slightly Pierce is it's perfect for it. <laughs> That's what we got to get right there. We use what is Allen, it? Allen wrenches. Allen wrenches. The amount of oh flow. Oh my god. No so much flow. Restriction. Holy shit. Look at this. I think that's three inches wide. I think it's like two and a half. Yeah, this is two and a half. This is three. There you go. Ow! That's hot. Yeah, what yeah. the fuck do you think was gonna happen? Come on, use that Tony Sanch muscle. Thank you. I wonder what it's gonna sound like if I just turn the car on right now. Just for chits and giggles, we're gonna start the car. See what it sounds like with literally nothing restricting it. Oh my god. There it is. We're gonna marry it up there. Pretty straightforward, but I mean, hopefully we don't screw it up. Very useful stuff, anti-seize. Highly recommended to put that on anything that gets hot, such as your spark plugs or your O2 sensors. Just take a little bit. Dude, that looks like Hershey's chocolate, man. No. Well, don't eat it, it's bad. Oh, no, no, <laughs> holy shit, I can smell it from here. It does, now it looks like shit. Highly recommended to put this, but don't get it on the sensor because it can't damage the sensor. Get that German spec, I call it Guten Tight. Alright, you hold it, and then you go. Where's the bolt? Oh, the bolt's <laughs> down there. Fuck. There you go. Is it on? Yeah, at that point it's on, just need to tighten it up some more. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this will be all on here, just like so. So that's basically installed. Mm -hmm. All I gotta do is tighten everything up at this point. Getting the V band to fit correctly around it. Like it needs to be flush like all the way around. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's been a little bit of a beat. Just playing bullshit games. Yeah. Yep. Can you see it? Like how it's not fitting? Yeah. yeah. Yep. No problem. No. Oh, yeah. Really don't want to, so we just tightened everything back up and mm -hmm. all looks pretty good. We had a little bit of problems with the, the yeah, what is the it, the flange, the V-band? Well, we had a little bit of problems with the V-band, yeah, but, fucking see where it is. Yeah, yeah. but we figured it out. So now everything, V-band went on nicely. 
Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you to Jay-Z. Nick came over here. Yeah, he sorted it all out. We got everything tightened up. Looks yeah. good, man. Wait to see how it sounds. Stage two tune coming soon. Yeah. It was Definitely hear the turbo. Hold Holy on. shit. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna put the other Snapchat. Dude, the turbo. Turb skis! Okay, so honestly, it's not like not much louder because we still have the stock like muffler on it, but you could definitely, you hear, you could definitely hear the turbo now, right? You definitely hear that. Oh whistle. my god. Like, just the whistle sounds great. Just tighten everything up. Last couple of pieces. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and that pretty much just wraps it up. Mm -hmm. um, thanks this guy for letting us use his garage um, and for all the help. Go, overall, you pleased? Yeah, let's sit down on the street and uh, see what it sounds like. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, see you later.